consistency is a is a word you're gonna hear a lot um yeah. on this on this show i mean gc beat said the same thing and he said it that actually he feels as though it's a cliche answer but cliches are just answers that are often repeated and, and you hear producers often repeat that consistency is what um transform their hobby into a business what specifically changed in your routine or in your habits or in your mind state that contributed to that level of consistency i would say uh, i made a video about this however really treating artists like people i know that probably sounds cliche but i have realized that when i stress so much about money I start to do a lot of things out of desperation and, you know, start to kind of forget that these are actual people that have invested into my brand and I should act like I, not act like I care, but actually care, you know? Um, so I, once I started to realize like these are people and building up value and companies, entrepreneurs always talk about value and I always thought like, okay, value, but it's really true. Like giving value to your audience can definitely go a long way um and i also realized that it was a process i think a lot of times when i tried to rush certain things i may have gotten a result but it wasn't either a long-term result or the result i was really looking to get so i would say treating my customers like humans and also finding out who my customer base is and just studying i, I i've noticed that's one thing a lot of people just want the answer like like this and they don't really take the time to study information there's a lot of resources just like you know it starts as a bunch of resources that you can find for free with people talking about what they've done step by step uh so there's really in my opinion no excuse um when it comes to not knowing it's just taking the time to actually learn about your business and get into those goals Okay, this is this is maybe a tough question, um, but I'm going to okay. put you on the on the spot. Uh, what what was was one th action you took or one marketing move you made out of desperation back before you started switching your mind state? Oh, I mean, I sold beats like I did. I sold exclusives at like fifty bucks, like I just just to make some money, and I I still look back on that. I'm like, dang, why did I do that? You know, but I I would do certain things out of like I know people will buy this, so I'm gonna just do it. I'm gonna sell, you know, fifty dollar exclusives, which there's nothing wrong with that if that's what you do. But for me, I knew that long term, that's not something I could have continued doing. Um, so I definitely did that out of desperation. Um, in regards to my business.